y'all welcome back to my channel if you're new hello i'm carly <laughs> i've been planning to do a video like this for quite a while actually but an opportunity came about from carly bible's channel i'll link her right here she's doing a giveaway that kind of blended with my idea for this video so i just put them together so this will also be my entry for her giveaway i just wanted to give some ideas how to make the world a better place. It is hard to think about world peace and changing the world when you're an individual, but if we all take on tasks that can make our part of the world better, that can really help make a difference and hopefully make the world better place. Peace and harmony. <laughs> Please give this video a thumbs up because who doesn't love world peace? My first way to help the world become a better place is to donate things. I personally always donate to Goodwill, but you can donate to foster homes or other homeless shelters, even younger kids. I just, per I don't know, for some reason I just donated to Goodwill growing up. My next idea was to put coins in other people's meters while they're out shopping or doing something. To just put some coins in people's meters when you're just walking by. It could be a nickel or a dime or a quarter. I put in quarters just because that's just what I had on me at that moment. My third idea was to make bags to give to homeless people when you see them. Sorry for the interruption, but I just wanted to share that as I was editing this part of the film of me putting together my bags, I was sitting in Starbucks. Someone approached me, but he didn't say anything. He had a sign that was probably this big and he just put it in front of my face and I was like editing. I, was, I, I close out the world when I'm in Starbucks. The sign said, please help. I, I didn't know at that moment that like, he just caught me off guard because I was inside of Starbucks. Like I wasn't out walking down the street and someone approached me. I was just sitting and sipping my tea and just doing my thing. It just totally caught me off guard. Typically I'm like, oh, I'm just doing my thing. Like I don't feel like talking. I, I didn't know if he was gonna like have a spiel or like what if he was gonna say anything, but he couldn't, he didn't say anything. He just held the sign in front of me and he was like mouthing stuff that he, he wanted to say stuff, but he couldn't verbalize. So I don't know if he just knew how, to, I don't, I don't know. But I kind of just brushed him off and, and then I thought of my bag that I had in my car. I need to come up with a name for those bags. I was thinking Peace Pack, I don't know. But I had one of the bags in my car. I gave him one of the bags and he was really, really thankful and really, I, I told him, I don't know what you need. He couldn't communicate with what he needed. He just said, the sign just said, please help. I handed him the bag and I said, take this whole bag. I don't know what you need. I, I don't understand what you need, but this is what I can give you. He was so thankful. I mean, he was just like, he lit up and it was really nice. So that was like awesome that I, Got to give away the bag so soon, like a day after, or two days after I made them. Anyway, roll footage. <laughs> so my cousins and I went to Walmart and we decided to pick up some things to create these bags. They were so much help. In my packages, I'm including a pair of socks, first aid kit, chapstick and sunscreen, toothbrush and toothpaste, some fruit and other food, bar of soap and a notepad and pen. Any other items can come in handy too. These are just the ones that my cousins and I thought of when we were putting these together. A little bit can go a long way, so if even if it was just a thing of fruit, or even if it was just toothbrush and toothpaste, or just a pair of socks, they'd be very thankful. My fourth idea is something that I've been wanting to do for a while. Where I park my car, for a very long time I thought it was a vacant house, then I realized an old man lived there, so I decided that I should just pick up his trash. I know that he's unable to do it. My last idea here was to just show leaving a sweet comment can really make someone's day. I strongly believe in being kind and spreading kindness, but you most certainly don't only have to be kind in social media. You should always be kind to anyone that you come encounter with. You really don't know what type of story or background that they came from.
wanted to say to Carly Bible if you're watching this, I love the positivity that you spread because more people need to be that way from one young woman to another. I wanted to thank you for spreading such good and positive energy and really trying to make a difference because you do make a difference. So I just wanted to say thank you. I hope you watch this. Bye.